Austin because it is a beautiful start Ooh, yeah. to the day. Yeah, it really is. Take a look at the sunrise here in Fort Lauderdale. Just a really nice start here to the day. Our temperatures are also not too bad either. We're waking up to temps in the mid 70s. We'll climb into the upper 80s by the afternoon here. But what you can also expect this afternoon, not too much of this though. We're going to have some storms though in the mix later on. We're also under that flood watch here and it's going to last through the evening, especially for our, our uh, coastal communities here. And this could be anywhere in Broward all the way down through Miami Dade here as well. So as I mentioned, we're going to stay clear here this morning. You're noticing that as you step outside this morning, but as we get closer to about lunchtime, that's we could start to see some of the storms start to pop up. The activity uh, really starting to ramp up in the early afternoon hours here. Take a look by 2 p.m. This is when we could see some storms storm stretching anywhere inland over closer to the coast. And this is, of course, in that area where that flood watch is in effect here. So stretching from Homestead through Miami up through Fort Lauderdale. Now the storm sticking around through about five or six. But look, then things clear out by about 8 p.m. And then they pretty much stay that way uh, for the rest of the evening until tomorrow. That's when we expect much of the same a clear morning, but then storms are back in the picture by the afternoon. So again, still under that flood watch here through this evening. We'll have a high of about 87 afternoon storms definitely in the mix. Moving into Thursday, a high of about 88 degrees. We're getting just a little bit warmer over the course of the next couple of days here, but the scattered storms are definitely staying in the mix. As we look closer toward the end of the weekend, Sunday, we'll still have that steamy sun out there. Take a look. We'll likely get closer to about 90 by Sunday. Afternoon storms still in the mix, and you're also going to feel that humidity. We could even be getting just over 90 degrees by Monday and Tuesday.